we're going to start thinking about winterizing these hives. And I've got Dale Large with me. I noticed that there's no bearding going on on the outside of the hive. The what? What? Too cold. Okay. If it's around 55 degrees or below, they'll stay inside. Here, can you see right here, this little black dot? We've got some beetles in the hive, and I've been reading about this, but Dale, can yeah, you talk I'm about a, what I'm they're... I've got them bad this year. You've got them bad this year? Is it because of the moisture outside? We've had so much rain. So wet. We've had so much rain, and we've had so much humidity, so much moisture consistently that um, the beetles just come, and it's part of nature. Is. Vinegar and olive oil into the trap, and we're placing the trap inside the hive. And that's going to stay here that stays on permanent. permanently so that we can get rid of the beetles. Only two? Mm -hmm. Okay, and that's enough. Well, they could. Usually one's sufficient, but this one's the obvious. Dale, do beetles get in the way of um, honey production? Mm -hmm. Definitely. They they get too bad that they destroy their whole hog. Okay. What this does is give you space for the feeder. Okay, so this is like a, a, a brood super. Yeah, it's a, what it is, it's a brood box. A brood box, and we're putting it on top of the hive because we're going to give enough space to add a feeder to the hive. Turn it upside down. It'll drip into your hives to the top super. Okay. Now, um, where can you get this? Brushy Mountain? Yeah. Man Lake. Don't worry about them. I got a hundred. Okay. But that'll last for approximately two weeks. Okay. And after two weeks, you can take it off. Okay. Put your top back. Back. Okay. You don't want to leave it on in the winter time. All right. So we're putting the inner lid back on. Okay. I'm gonna go get the sticks. Putting the sticks here because that's what's going to hold the feeder for the winter. Get a little smoke. Let them know. Relax. Than a okay, did you, um, did you, let me just see what you did out front there. Yeah, these are nasty here. They're upset. We're not even taking anything from them. We gave them something. Just put a drywall screw through it. No, that's it. You just do one screw to make sure it doesn't blow away. It. Yeah, they're not happy. from Dale after he left this morning and he told me that one of the remedies for getting rid of beetles in the hive is pouring a gallon of bleach around the base of the hive in my case around my cinder block so that's what I'm here to do
made the straps for the um, to strap down the hives here so that if we have any large winds and we need to get here in a hurry and strap down the hives they'll be here for cold weather.